How's that? How's that coffee treating you? It's good. Yeah. You ready to shred? Yeah, we went to Zeke's. Woo! <laughs> Taking the skateboard. Oh, coffee on my skateboard. Lame. See you, man. It's mine now. First incision. All right, all right. I gotta, I gotta feel it. Find the right spot here. Don't poke yourself. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Is that where you wanted it? Uh, sure. It's where it is. It's where it's gonna be. Yeah. See, if I was really fancy, I would like duct tape it so it has some like protection, you know. But. All right, just cut a hole in my backpack. We on now. There's no turning back. Yeah. And, uh... yeah. Like a glove. <laughs> Can you see my skateboard? What skateboard? Yeah, you must exactly. What are you talking about? <laughs> Is it super obvious? It no. I have no idea. There's a skateboard there. Yeah. You're like concealing yes. it. Yeah, it's totally like <laughs> it wedged in there. It just looks like you have a really lumpy ass. It's like the only thing. It's, it's convenient that the people who do security, they it's fine for you to have a skateboard there. So it doesn't matter about that part. Yeah, the they don't care. Is that I can't have a spirit staff person see and like try and charge me for it. Yeah. But the reality is that probably none of this mattered at all. It's, it's $40 per flight and I have two connecting flights. Yep. So that would mean for me to actually check in a skateboard it would cost 80 bucks there and 80 bucks back. The skateboard cost me $60. <laughs> so I could buy two skateboards. I feel like this could work. It's it, it, yeah. it's already working, man. It's not that uncomfortable. Like, you have no idea. Yeah, I have no idea. Anyway. I have no idea that you have a skateboard. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at that.
The only weird part is like just being on the plane and then and then yanking that out. Yeah. People are like, dude, what the hell? <laughs> Where did that come from? See ya. What's up, everybody? This is Cody here in Pittsburgh in my beautiful, messy apartment that needs to be cleaned, so I do apologize. Just kindly disregard everything behind you. Finishing up today's video, which is what you just saw a minute ago, uh, it's so weird because like it's not done yet, but by the time you see it, it will be done. So it's just one of those things. This is like a preemptive, like, I hope you enjoyed this thing that I'm currently finishing. For those that don't know me, like I said, my name's Cody. I was introduced to Jack Pittman a few months ago through our mutual friend Hasib, who's actually engaged to my cousin. So my cousin, Hasib, engaged, living in Wheeling. They've known Jack for a really long time. I live here in Pittsburgh. Jack has been living with uh, my cousin and my cousin Kelly and her fiance Hasib for a few months now there in Wheeling. So Jack and I have been hanging out for quite a bit and getting to know each other and spending a lot of time riding skateboards, uh, talking about YouTube, talking about a lot of travel as well, and generally just kind of getting to know each other better. And uh, I can confidently say he's one of my one of my closest friends that I have. So shout out to you, Jack. I know you're traveling in California right now and you're trying to get your skateboard on the plane. I hope everything's going well. I know you're keeping me updated, man. So by the time you're seeing this, you should be in California, hopefully with your skateboard in hand. So I actually started doing daily vlogs on YouTube. This is number 42, so 42 days ago. And I sort of just decided to do it after talking to Jack for a while. It just seemed like a good idea. It was kind of one of those things where, you know, I've been struggling lately with uh, some anxiety and a little depression. And it was one of those things just to kind of keep me in check and keep me focused and, you know, show to myself, prove to myself that I can fulfill my days with exciting, fun things to capture and remember so that I, did, I was going through a phase where I wasn't working either. So I was just feeling like every day was the same and I wasn't doing anything. And so I started doing these vlogs to really help prove to myself that I am capable of doing exciting things on a daily basis and getting out and traveling and just enjoying time outside of my apartment. You can see I, I haven't I haven't really been uh, keeping up up to date with um, the cleanliness, which is about to change because my brother is on his way from South Carolina right now. So I gotta I gotta get this done so I can get this cleaned up. So I've been keeping myself pretty strict as far as being able to upload every day, and Jack has been helping me out quite a bit um, as far as you know finding things to film, um, editing techniques, keeping me just reminding me why it's important to upload every day. So I hope you guys enjoy it. If you want to give me a subscribe and follow me, totally cool. Really just hoping to um, to meet people out of this, you know. I want to get to know some other people in the YouTube community. I want to get to know some people just across the world. I mean, people connect all the time. Well, actually, Jack and I met a new friend today at the skate park named Alex, uh, who you saw shredding up a couple a couple times throughout the uh, throughout the video. Props to you, Alex, man. If you're watching this, dude, you're a cool dude. Let's hang out. Hope everyone's doing well. Um, you know, drop a comment or, uh, you know, you can subscribe. I don't really care <laughs> if you want to. Um, you know, just introduce yourself, man. I'm Cody. Good to meet you guys. Take care.